Hello people, and welcome back to another Minds of Insanity single player beta! Yeah, uh, fuck, I just botched the title, but w whatever, you know what I'm getting at. So, yeah, just continuing with business as usual. I did do something off camera, uh, I turned all that gravel into fucking flint that I was doing in the last episode when I ended. Um, I know, it, it's... Oh, shit, this again. Ah, fuck. Yeah, these are the Phantom Minions. I plan on telling Atomic Striker about this, see if he'll do something about it. Um, but until that can happen, uh, it's, it's all just a bunch of bullcrap. So, um, yeah, I'm going to set the Minions to work in the, uh, in the Slave Mines, as I've become to begrudgingly call it, and, um, yeah, we'll see what happens. Uh, strip mine, strip mine, strip mine, strip mine. Strip mine. Well, they dug right into Lapis. I'll just leave them to do that. But yeah, it shouldn't be too long before we're uh, wealthy enough for, you know, equivalent exchange items such as an energy condenser, which by the way, will be very, very useful to us because look at all this shit. We could turn a lot of this into um, some very valuable materials. So, yeah, that'll be nice. Uh, actually, it probably isn't too late to get some of the materials together. I think we actually have everything. Yeah, we have diamond, we have coal. Oh, wait. I think you need charcoal for that. Uh, we have iron. Yeah, here, I'll, uh, I'll burn up a piece of charcoal. And we have stone. We have stone. Um, I'll get a couple of pieces of charcoal. Because I think covalence dust requires charcoal. Diamond and coal. Yep, makes the high covalence dust. Redstone and iron, medium covalence dust, and then uh, low covalence is cobble and charcoal. Okay, so we've got cobble. Oh, there's some cobble right there. Okay. Yeah, when I was making this house, I just threw a whole bunch of the cobble away because it was taking up too much space. Mm. Oh, great. Just what I needed. Minions coming in here, handing me a whole bunch of shit while I'm working. Now, where did they drop it? I didn't put it in there. Okay. So... Oh, right. I needed that wood for a chest. Right? And I'll probably need these iron ingots. Uh, okay. Let's see here. Ch 
chest. <laughs> Iron ingot, diamond. Okay. Stone. Low, medium, high, and boom. Okay. Now. Four obsidian, four diamonds. Let's see if we have enough diamond. Yep. Three obsidian, fuck no, no. Just one more, one more obsidian. I don't have to go back down to those fucking mines. God damn it, we're out of obsidian. Uh, okay. I'm gonna go mine some more obsidian. Here, let's see what these jabbering idiots are doing. WHAT ARE YOU DOING?! STOP! <laughs> what the hell? Why would you mine the wall? Oh! Damn, minions! Okay, minions doing work here! Okay. Okay. Now I gotta figure out which one of you little idiots just mind up my wall. No. Maybe it was you. It's your blue. No, do not mind my wall again. I have to patch this shit now. Still gotta go down and find some obsidian though, so. Geronimo. You know, is, Ger is saying Geronimo before you jump culturally insensitive? I wouldn't think it is. I mean, well, I don't exactly know why they say Geronimo when it comes to jumping off of something. You know, that's the, that, that reminds me of a lot of these dumbass sayings we have. There's a lot of them that just don't make any friggin' sense at all. Did I... Ah, damn it, I did not bring my water bucket. It's fine, it's fine. I should be able to find at least one or two pieces of obsidian. Hmm. Yeah, I'll never understand that phrase, Geronimo. Who shouts somebody's name when they jump? I know I don't. Hmm. Weird. Seems like I can't place a block here, but I should be able to. Okay. <sighs> Just a couple obsidian. Maybe enough for an enchanting table also. And I'll be done. I say that, but I'm probably going to have to come up with some kind of way of farming obsidian. Uh, well, I mean, once I make an energy condenser, obsidian's not going to be a problem. Just put in 64 cobblestone and get out one obsidian. <laughs> I love equivalent exchange. Okay. I'll just teleport back out of here, because I don't feel like walking all the way back up. Okay. So, we have the diamonds. We have the obsidian. 
and we have the alchemical chest. And boom. We have the energy condenser. So let me put some of this stuff in here. Okay. See, let me get the silver and gold cinnabar out and put them in here to smelt. Let's see here, what is it? Oh yeah, diamond, glowstone, and... Yeah, we should have just enough glowstone dust. Oh, right, I need redstone. Yeah. You know something? I hate to speak ill of a mod's original creator here, but... The guy who made EE3, let, let's be honest, EE3 is terrible. Compared to EE2, it is, it is a market loss. I mean, this thing, this thing is so useful. I love this thing. This, this thing makes everything so convenient. If, if I need light, uh, the friggin' energy collector can provide it. If I need energy, it's so easy to just grab a whole bunch of cobble out of here and turn it all into whatever I want. I mean, it is not difficult at all to do this. Oh my god, I didn't even notice that stack of 45 iron. Actually, let me grab one more thing. What the hell?! Oh my god, are these walls made of... Oh my god. Oh my god, they are. When the hell did this happen? Okay, I am I am scared now. Um I guess some silverfish got in somehow. I'm not sure. <sighs> but yeah, let me uh put this iron in one of these furnaces here and I'll uh I'll turn all of this cobblestone into something. Let me get some stone and turn it into some stone bricks so I can fix my destroyed basement. <sighs> it's always something, ain't it? Yeah, that'll be good. There we go. Much better. So, now we have a way to produce uh, an infinite amount of anything by simply exchanging one thing for another. So, first, I would like to exchange this for some obsidian. 
and that's more than enough obsidian. I don't need any more. Uh, let's see. And then... See, I know I had some books around here somewhere. Ah, uh, yes, some books and some wood. I think you all know where I'm going with this. Yes, bricks for books. Yes, I only need four. Three to use, and two to keep. Now I can freely transmute bookshelves. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is quite useful. Just a moment. Gotta check something. Okay. Now. Uh, let's see. I have the Philosopher's Stone. I might as well see about a transmutation table. Oh, okay, yeah. Just obsidian and Cook stone. That'll be useful. Yeah, let me uh, get these two together. And I know it doesn't use the stone when crafting. Should I go ahead and turn it into a transmutation tablet? Eh, I don't know. Okay, so a transmutation table. Now, is there a benefit of a tablet over a table? You know, it's not actually that much more expensive. I might as well do it now. I like my doge. My doges are always going around yapping, saying bork. Is it, is it in reverse? Oh, shit! Oh, hell no! No, 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 no! Portability is not worth that much! Okay, okay. yeah, no, portability is not worth that much. I am sorry. Okay. But this should help me use some stuff. So, yeah, now we have... Uh, Basic transmutation equipment. Those ender lily seeds are taking fucking forever to grow. Um, maybe we should look into upgrading to diamonds soon. Uh, and then here's all the doges. They're, they're being doge. If I start getting some cats, they're probably going to kill one another. Okay, what should I do next? Oh, right, I was going to use these to make some arrows, but do I have feathers? Feathers, feathers, feathers. I mean, I could go out and kill a chicken. Oh, there's one running loose behind the house. I'll go do that. Instead of slaughtering one of my own chickens, I'll slaughter a wild one instead. Oh, hello, little stray rabbit. You're one of them that escaped, eh? Ah, there you are, chicken. There. You know, I remember used to animals would actually spawn. Skeleton, you are not wanted here. <laughs> yeah, just walk up and brutally murder it with two strikes of the sword. Hello, bunnies. Sheep. Oh, look. 
Mm. Another stray rabbit. Eh, I won't chase him down. I've got enough rabbits that I can effectively feed myself forever with them. Though I may want to tame a griffin soon. But, uh, it's looking to be at about that time where the video needs to end. So, I'll see you all next time. Goodbye!